Hello friends, welcome to Electronic Circuit Hub. So today we are going to learn about the design of differential mode filter. Okay. So today I'll calculate the value of differential mode inductor. So in the last video we, we have understood about the design of common mode choke. How will you design the common mode choke? What is how will you calculate the inductance value of common mode choke so in this video we'll focus on calculating the value of differential mode differential mode drum or differential mode inductor okay so let me explain this right away so for the differential mode the if you remember from the last video to calculate the differential mode inductance ld you can see the formula this is ld this LD stands for differential mode inductance. So to calculate the differential mode inductance, you can see here, you need to have the RL value, that means load resistance value, and it is sometimes called the input impedance of your LISN network, okay? That is 50 ohm. You need to have the zeta value, for the differential mode the zeta value is 0 0.5 for common mode it was 0 0.7 now you need to have uh, you need to have one more parameter that is fc so cutoff frequency so for the moment we know all these three parameters we know the rl value that is 50 ohm we know the zeta value that is 0 0.5 uh, we also know the cutoff frequency okay so if you ask me i don't know for this video what is the cutoff frequency so i did i explained in the last video how will you calculate the cutoff frequency so let me go you in the flashback before i explain this okay so to calculate the cutoff frequency you can see here fc equals to fc stands for cutoff frequency equal to f into switching frequency this is f switching fc equals to f switching into 10 to the power attenuation divided by 40 okay so you can see here i have calculated the value of fc and in this case we had we had minus 30 db attenuation we had switching frequency 65 kilohertz and you can see then i calculated the cutoff frequency which is 11.55 kilohertz so uh, so for this for the calculation of differential mode inductance or uh, differential mode inductance value i'll use the fc value directly from here okay directly from here so it's 11 11 point Five, five. So now you know how will you calculate the FC value. So to calculate the FC value, you need to have the switching frequency and you also need to have the attenuation factor. So this is minus 30 and switching frequency is 65 kilohertz. So I directly, I directly put these value in the here in this formula and let me show you in the Excel. You can see I, I, I put the formula here and you can see the differential mode inductance value here is 344 micro handy so you have drum core here so you can bind your uh your inductor and you can achieve this inductance value that is 344.4 micro handy and you have to also decide the wire gauge and that is as per rms current calculation okay as per rms current calculation you can decide the wire gauge okay so guys now i hope that you you are able to design the differential mode inductor as well so in the last video here you can see i explained to design the common mode common mode filter common mode choke value so if you have any further question feel free to ask me in comment section thanks for watching this video guys